off to get my allergy tested today and I'm actually kind of nervous I know they're gonna be pricking my my arms with needles so I'm gonna see if um, I can get Shane to vlog what they're doing do you think they'll have a problem just, just don't show their face if they're not but yeah it's um, uh, allergy test for alcohol so that I can figure out if I can actually drink some type of alcohol versus the other kinds, I guess. So it'd be good to know. I mean, I don't mind just drinking like Moscato and things. What kind of drink is a Moscato? Wine. It's wine. Okay. So wine's good for me. I don't need to be taking shots or anything like that. But so excited. I'm pretty sure other people at work are more excited than I am because they, I don't know. They drink a lot and they just want to party with me for some reason. But yeah, okay, we'll see inside the doctor's office. Here we go. I'm kind of scared. I should have taken a shot already. I'm just kidding. <laughs> to get uh, relaxed. Here you go. Dr. Z. Let's see if you can record me while he pokes me in the arm. He said he has some wine here. I don't know for what. By the way, I haven't seen him. Patient in one life, but you, yeah. Really? Um, the other problem is the face, the pain, flush, red, very common. Okay, then you get abdominal discomfort, but not just only with that symptom. Oh. And uh, some deficiency they have in the inside. Do you and think it's in my head? No, 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 it's on your head. You have done it a couple of times. Yeah. And only one time, because so. of one occasion it might be. Okay. So I'll put for you. Okay. And uh, this is the uh, water cons control. Okay. I'll put a drop here for you. This is why it has sulfate. This sulfate. Alcohol, they all have yeast. Let's make them bright. Yeast. And this is the grapes. Green or red? Yeah. And this is the wine by itself. Uh. And then this is the histamine, every reactive histamine. I call it histamine because somebody red flashed. Okay. It's a control this water. So what I do, I have to poke you a little bit, just touch your skin, so they go under the skin. And then this can do the statue, the hardly feel it. Okay. And then this can do the chemical, they call it histamine. And histamine from the pub. Okay? Mm -hmm. So let's use sulfate, grapes, wine, and histamine. That's all it is. So we have to wait for 15 minutes. The system is going to be red like this. Yeah. And itchy. So for the itchy to them, they become like the same as okay. And get itchy, so it's going to be itchy here. I get a picture of it. All right, so I was only allergic to, well, the histamine. But other than that, nothing really happened. That blotch right there is just uh, the antihistamine, I believe. So he told me to just um, put drops of alcohol under my tongue and see what happens. Just go slowly, one drop, and then the next day, two drops under my tongue, and then see how I feel. And then I said, so then by next week, have a glass? He's like, no, just keep going slow. So I'm going to do that at home then. What do you think I should Use first, like Patron. Or I don't know if it's gonna be like a wine or a vodka. Like, well, I want to drink wine, so I'll just do wine. I don't care for other. Alcohol. So the doctor just told me to just get my blood tested because nothing came out of that, and he told me to do the home test just to actually try drops of alcohol. And then he also said that I was the first patient ever. <laughs> to ever come with that symptom, I guess. Because other people who's allergic to alcohol actually have external things that show. 
like they turn red or whatnot. So he actually wants to be, uh, he wants me to keep him posted on what happened to my blood test. Pretty sure he's gonna get a copy of my test. But, well, thanks for coming. No problem. I've been dying for some Korean food, so I'm very excited. It's not even five yet, but it's early dinner because we're gonna go to bed early because we did not go to bed early yesterday. Because somebody needed me to drive his ass around safely. And I had to stay up past midnight on a Sunday. What is that about? Okay, so I'm gonna order the kimchi, kimchi spicy soup. Ooh, can't see it. It's that, and then I'm gonna get ox blood. I thought it was pork blood. And then Shane's ordering this. Yep. He's like, yeah, let's just see what happens. <laughs> because you know, when you go to Korean restaurants, they actually or the way Korean people eat, um, they have little side dishes, right, to share. So be full from that but I'm probably just gonna end up eating all of it because Shane doesn't like anything that's not Canadian or burnt. Food's here. I no mushroom. Thank you. Thank you very much. Excited. Is that good? Will do. Yep. <laughs> okay. So I don't really know how to use these kind of chopsticks, but this is some sort of jello. I don't know. I think that's white radish. Oh no, it's not. It's soft. Bean sprouts. Kimchi, sweet potato. This is so good. That looks okay. Killed it. Kind of. I just drank, drank, ate all the broth. It's my fave. He killed it. Hey, you don't eat your vegetables. Why? Not a fan. Not a fan of zucchini? You grow zucchini. Hey guys, um, we're off to see ZZ Top. All right. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> That's a sad myself. Yeah, I bought, um, it was uh, before Christmas, I think. I bought Brad tickets to go see them because he, I don't know, I played a really mean joke on him and <laughs> said that they were coming to town and he was so excited. And then I was like, oh, I'm just kidding. So then I felt bad, so I actually bought tickets to go see him. See them. See, I don't even know. I'm like, see him? I don't know. Their group, I guess. <laughs> they got big long beards. Yeah, the Duck a... Dynasty guy. Even, no, 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 no. no. Looking guy, Way looking bigger. guy. <laughs> okay, well, we're gonna go see them, so, okay. So we found- We should have parked there. Juliana's parking spot. Check it out. Cool girl has a reserve spot. Where's your car? <laughs> Where your car at, Jay Bear? <laughs> so we're having dinner first at this place called Unido Restaurant. We have the restaurant to ourselves. Good thing we yep. made a reservation. Yeah, <laughs> I can pull some strings, you know. <laughs> and then we got put in the corner. I called, I called. I called ahead. Mm. Made sure they cleared out the place. Romantic. Thanks. Mm. That looks good. Oh, smells really good. Mm -hmm. oh, thanks. <laughs> Just so ugly. Mm, this lasagna looks really, really good. It smells good. We got some Brussels sprouts and his ravioli. And he bit his tongue twice. <laughs> Say it, too slowy. Slowy. <laughs> I was gonna say slower and slowly. Slowy. <laughs> I will. I will eat slowly. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Thanks, baby. Salamat. Walang anaman. What did you say? I said walang anaman. To 10. Yeah, it is to 10 o'clock. 
See, you are now watching. You are now watching Kate through the eyes of the parking meter. <laughs> Stupid. So Vancouver, it's seven days a week. You have to pay for parking, 9 a.m. to 10 p.m. The fudge. It used to be till like eight or something. Seven. Eight. Can you hold it? Parking meter has a cup holder. Hey, okay, this one is expired. This guy. Is Okay, so you're, uh, Kate, you're gonna really notice a different age category here than at the JT concert. Um, Queen Elizabeth Theater, this is actually where I graduated. This is where our ceremony was, high school. Cool. Coming to you live from the Queen Elizabeth Theater. Theater? <laughs> so I told him to record how many people there are here. It's like, check out. Apparently they're a big deal. Place is popping. And there's like a bunch of scalpers and whatnot. Can I sell my ticket or what? <laughs> Did you want to come with me or not? You? <laughs> Just I've done, kidding. I've done that before. I've sold a ticket and then the guy that bought the ticket for me, the scalper, yeah. came and sat beside me because he couldn't resell it. <laughs> <laughs> awkward. So the opening act just finished. <laughs> I'm eating this stuff. It's good. <laughs> They're called Flash Lightning. They're all good. They're talented. Yeah, they were good. Okay, they're good. I liked it. Yeah. yeah. Rocking. Yeah. We're just waiting for the main act to come out. We're like center, but higher up, middle. So there's the floor, and then us. What is this? Me mezzanine. Mezzanine, and then the balcony up top. And I was telling Brad that there's going to be confetti's coming down at the end because I only already saw two fall. They ruined. Ladies and gentlemen, it's party time. Please make welcome for your rocking pleasure. ordinary for me. It's interesting though, they were pretty entertaining. Hmm. <laughs> How come you didn't stand up? When? During the show? Yeah. Because well, nobody in the mezzanine level was, so I didn't want to bug the people behind us. I think I was like the youngest one there. Oh, come on. And then Brad was next. Okay, I said you're next! <laughs> yes! <laughs> yeah, definitely an older demographic for sure. Yep. You enjoy it? Yeah, it was fun. Putting air in my tires right now. What? It's not. You doesn't need it. Okay. Doesn't need it. That's awful bad, but it's not bad. Do you know what it's supposed to be at? Thirty-five. I don't know. Shane says it's flat, but he doesn't think it is. Anyways, so he was trying to get out of my car, and like super snob, he was like 
go like this to it and then he's like let me out like hello i have this button on that side too i said geez babe like my car is older but it's not that ghetto like so pissed such a snob Ugh. just because your car is newer Aaron, thanks. Like epic. Okay, so oh. we walked into Starbucks <laughs> and I was talking to Brad and all of a sudden he freaking burst out laughing like uncontrollably. I'm like, what the hell? And I look behind me, there's this guy with a, I can't even explain. Can you explain? There's this guy with a mustache. Big massive handlebar mustache. It was like this thick, coming off, curled up with the wax. It stuck out. <laughs> Stuck out like this far. Yeah. Oh, so was... when he when he had when he had his back turned, when he had his back turned, you could still Stuck see the tips of it. <laughs> yeah, you see the tips of it from like the sides. It, it was it was different, and Brad was killing himself laughing. I'm like, what the heck? shut up. <laughs> so ugly. And then she wouldn't vlog it. I couldn't. I... It's rude. How do you do that? <laughs> you, I don't know. You vlog statues. You vlog other things, He's buildings, not a and people. No, He's... that that freaking mustache was a statue. <laughs> uh, yeah, missed it. Sorry. I don't know what that is. It is so weird. It was like tasted like water. There is nothing in it. Try one. No, oh, it's so weird. It tastes like water. It tastes like nothing. But try it. Just try it. You have to have your adventure one at least once. It's the least. Um, what's the word? The least dangerous. <laughs> then you have to describe to us. Wait. Exactly like you said it. Right. Mhm. Mm so what is it? Are you gonna throw up? <laughs> your face. Swallow, nice. it. swallow it. Let's go. <laughs> Describe it. it. Tastes like a jelly. I don't know. 